lot of all of our adventuring um, takes a lot of logistics, and I do a lot of that planning, and I'm also really um, committed to the content, to publishing the content, uh, just for memories and to share with everybody. So sometimes, and the areas we get into, it limits me from going live, and I do apologize. Um, but I hope to, I've got a lot of other Facebook pages I've been building, because some of the activities I'm doing are very specialized, and I realize, though, they're all dog-centric. Sometimes the people um, get um, aren't as interested, so I'm organizing the content in a way that can be more palatable for everybody. So, quick update, though. I'm in Maryland, as you all probably know, or you can see on the net, and we're getting ready to get a rainstorm for the next probably two days, and it's going to be torrential rains. So, we're trying to get a quick run in before the rain comes, because the dog's got to air it out, if you know what I'm saying. So, right now, I'm at a place we call the mill, and I'm going to give you a quick tour of the mill. Just what's going on here. So, Basically, that's the ATV I ride on. If you can see, it's all outfitted with cameras to bring 360 views and point of views and all that kind of good stuff. I've also got the dogs cameraed up, mic'd up, if you will. See if they say anything bad about me behind my back. <laughs> oh, I want to help say hello to everybody. Hello, Levi. Thank you for joining us. So, that's the dog bus, and I'll give you a quick view of the dogs. You haven't seen them in a while, I don't think. Jaggy boy! That's the Jagster. Princess, she's always ready to go. Princess, can you say hi to everybody? She's too busy looking at the cats that live here. Zorro is doing what Zorro does, waiting patiently. And here's the Chaster. He looks like he wants to give somebody a kiss. Chase, would you like to give a kiss? There he goes. All right, good boy. So, basically that's where we're at. Got some help on board today. Jimmy's with me. We're all rain-suited up and uh, ready for uh, torrential downfalls. Now we're gonna get out of here. Um, <laughs> thanks, Nick. Hey, we're, we're, we're doing what we can, I appreciate it. We're, um, I'm gonna turn the camera. We're gonna rock and roll. I figure we got a good, uh, hopefully 45 minutes to an hour before we get torrential downfalls. Now this area, let me uh, tell you, is um, uh, very swampy, for lack of a better description. So the streams here, uh, lots of waterways meander through here, and what's going to happen is uh, it's going to get real wet real quick. And the mud, the dogs love it. So I'm going to give them the mud. I'm going to give them their fill, basically. And, of course, getting traction in that mud is a little challenging. So that works their muscles a little better, gets their claws to grip, and works their uh, works muscles that they might not normally work if we didn't get out in these kind of conditions. So, and why I'm saying this, it's not raining now. It has rained some, and the torrential uh, downfalls are coming. And we won't be riding in too, too heavy torrential downfalls. So hopefully we won't ride in any. But just so you know, I'm going to post a video hopefully tonight or tomorrow. I'll give a link whether it's posted to the Wolf Driver page or not. You'll see a view from Zorro. He'll be wearing the camera today. And um, you'll also see a point of view and you'll, uh, from the ATV, so from what we're seeing. And you'll also see a 360 view if everything goes well. Sometimes it doesn't work out as planned. So once again, I'm going to give you a, a one more view. You're just joining us. I am the Wolf Driver. Uh, Jim is Wolf, Wolf Driver pit crew member. Jim is all... All bound up and ready to rock and roll in the wet conditions. We've got the ATV outfitted with the 360 camera, a point of view camera, and we're twirling around. And by the way, Zorro's got a camera on his. Zorro's ready to roll on his. That's Zorro's camera. So he's um, he's ready to do it too. He's ready to rock and roll. Um, and that's where we're at. By the and by the way, that's a GPS collar. So. Um, I hope to uh, get back to you soon with some updates. And if you don't hear from me in the next little while, call the uh, Calvary. Search for me. Because <laughs> we're going to be out here in the wet and wander. Uh, Wolf Driver signing off. M remember, stay up to date. I'll try to post more and come live at you more when um, conditions permit. As well as we're really doing a lot of the werewolves ghost hunting. And we're real proud of that. We've uh, got a lot of equipment. And... Uh, we've been going with uh, Curtis Weimer, who's our resident uh, ghost paranormal expert. So he's been joining us and giving us a lot of insights and explanations and helping us procure a lot of the evidence we're doing. Have a great day, everybody. Stay tuned. I'll be right back at you. Thanks so much.